we're going to point out some of the subtle differences in the Australian cowboy look. It's similar to the North American cowboy look, but it's different in a few key areas. And they call themselves stockmen sometimes too. They have a brand of jeans here called RM Williams, which is kind of roughly equivalent to Wrangler back home. But Wrangler sort of uh, moved in, so there's a lot of guys wearing Wranglers now in Australia. But they didn't, they didn't used to. These, this guy's got Wranglers. He's also got. They'll often do the. They'll pop. They like to pop the collars on their shirts. They like to do this thing. And they also. The hats are a little different. The hats are sort of. Uh, they like the felt hat, but it's more of a floppy kind of. A, where the brim flops down. And on the real hip, hipster cowboy guys, they'll have. Uh, on their hat band, they'll have they'll have sheep ear tags from the different stations they've worked on, and I think it's become a thing now where if you have a party, you sort of print up sheep tags as sort of like mementos of the party. So some guys will have like a couple of dozen of these sheep tags on their on their hat band. That's a very Australian thing to do. But yeah, they like to the shirt. They wear Western shirts, but they pop the collar and they roll the sleeves up. And they often wear Arm Williams uh, jeans. And uh, the hat's a bit floppier. Take another good shot of the hat there. It's kind of a floppy hat, sort of like what you see in the Civil War arena. But it's a very typical specimen of the uh, Australian stockman. And he'll be driving a ute, which is our equivalent of a pickup truck. And they don't really have so many pickups here. What they actually have are uh, those kind of cars with the open back, I think. What do they call them? Like, what are they? There's one make. El Caminos. El Caminos, uh, yeah, like El Caminos. And they call them utes, like as in utility vehicle. But they also call trucks utes. So there's a. Uh, Thank you.